Good luck, fellas. Good luck. You're ready to all die. the best. Put to your take investments. Them all off. You got the measure of your man and Any you know that you can go all the way. <laughs> give it to him. Yeah, give him a taste. Give it, give it. No my hooky my welcome back to another episode of the Kiwi NRL podcast. I think last week I said ninety eight on the show, but now yeah, it's ninety eight. Yeah, because uh, yeah, because when you sure. when you would go edit it after it, you're like oh ninety ninety seven. That's <laughs> <laughs> exactly what happened. Uh, episode ninety eight, two off the hundred, um, where we shall raise the bat. All right, and tonight in the studio, as per usual, we have Lucy Lefty, my dishevelled neighbour. <laughs> How are you, Jason? You're right. I'm good. You good, yourself? Mate? Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. And uh, out of nowhere, impact yes. off the bench. We've got Humwood, a brookie. How are you, mate? You good? I'm good, man. Yep. Ready to go? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He's oh ready yeah. To go. Skipped a few grades to get here, didn't you? Sure did. Oh, didn't even old. play New South Wales. <laughs> straight, straight in the squad. His dad's been coaching him all his life. <laughs> sure. Um, um, just before we go on, yeah. Tim Naki hit the millie. Yeah, you got the millie. That's out the gate. Couple of rough days, last couple of days, but <laughs> that's still crazy. Is yeah. that that guy that bets mm. for every follower? Yeah. Oh yeah. Barry hit the millie. I was so mean. What one a millie? Yeah, like the he's profit. had a million in profit so far. Oh wow! All up, all up, up the Naki. Yeah, I started following him. Up for a the bit. Tim the Naki. Oh, you, Lenny does follow him for the one liners. Yeah, it's, um, <laughs> <laughs> all those one liners are the best. This guy's. Should, oh, this guy should be out discovering masturbation. <laughs> <laughs> there's cum in his hair and there's cum in my pants. That was one of the best he's done. All right. Um, shout out to the sponsors, Fit Zone. As per usual, if you want to sort your, your mutters out, your rig, get down to Fit Zone, Matamata, Tiaroha, Paudor, and Waihi. Um, we've got the Foyt Challenge on at the moment, hence the um, non alcoholic beer. We'll get into that later. Um, but yeah, if you want to just sign up, even just book a tour to have a look around. Yeah. Head over to fitzonenz.com and uh, you'll find everything you need on there. Uh, also, shout out to Tamehana Consulting for all your people importing needs. Um, get hold of Dre. You just Google Dre to see what comes up. If you put doctor in front of it, it helps. Ah, yes. Google doctor. Get hold of Dr. <laughs> Dre. <laughs> um, he'll keep them imports ringing. So make sure to get hold of Andre if you need any staff. He's a good man. Staff, overseas He's a good man. staff. And if. Yeah, and he's really good if you just need like 10 bucks. Hit him up, Fano, yeah. 10 bucks if you need 10, 10 20 bucks. It's pretty good like that. Shout out to Dre and the team at Tummy Hunter Consulting because it is also his wife, Sam, who's part of that. So thank you for supporting the potty. And as per usual, that will bring us into our next segment, which is... Oh, yeah. I like that. You like that, eh? I like that. My <laughs> toy here. One toy hoy. Oh, sit on that duck. All right, that was PNC. That was tonight and tonight. Mm. This is the plug they didn't ask for, Jace, but it turns out they're going to get it. They're going to get that shit. And tonight it is fucking all day non alcoholic original IPA from Batch Brewing. Uh, last week we had the hazy, but this is just the IPA. Uh, I'm in the middle of the four week challenge, so I'm trying to stay off the mimi. Well, you, yeah, because you're going to have a blowout next weekend, most well, likely. Yeah, not every night, but during the week I'm trying to stay <laughs> off the beers. <laughs> 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 trying to stay off the beers, so these are great for that. So we'll have a taste. Montoya, Montoya, Montoya. That what is very good. Just one part I yes. What happens when you get to like the 250th episode and you've run out of bevies? Oh, I'll tell you what. Nose beers. No. no, it'll just be like <laughs> Galliano. Straight to the spirit. <laughs> nice. Okay, that's cool. Midori. Uh, I think Jace wanted to shelf a couple of pills, but... Hey. He, said, <laughs> <laughs> he said that off here, but I don't know if you need it. Everyone want to hear that, but yeah. Hey. But yes, shout out to um, Batch Bruco. They do the best labels, like we said last week. Look at it. Mm. Got the Pahutakawa tree, the Batch, the classic Kiwi Batch. You've got surfing. Um, you've got flowers. All sorts. Beach. Anyway, very refreshing. Thanks yes. for that. Very Kiwiana. 
Kiwi Hana. All right. Um, Nick Sugman, bro. That's just that, isn't it? Aye. How many dudes you know roll like this? How many dudes you know flow like this? Not many, infinity, not many, infinity. Hey, How many uh, dudes you know uh, got the skills to go and rock a show like this? Uh-uh, uh-uh, I don't know anybody. Oh, it's all good. All right, this is next segment. It's called Questions or Pata if you're speaking te reo Māori at home. And Jason, what is our first question, mate? Um, Kiwi NRL podcast. Don't know them. Never heard of them. Um, Cody Nicarima in the fold for Kiwis at the Mo. What well, do you think? Great game in the weekend. He's been bubbling away. He's been bubbling away mm. the whole season. Mr. Nicarima. Yeah. Be, would be a great number 14. Yes. Does he does he find his way in there at the moment? If you're gonna base it off like last form. week's game, Christ, that's, he was the best. He was the best six in the game. Unbelievable last weekend. The whole yeah. week, the, the round, I think he was the best. Like everything he touched was gold. It was great. Good for him. Mm. But is, is, is he maturing like the other boys now? You know, getting that maybe a eh? bit yeah. old, longer in the tooth, and all of a sudden they just I don't know they level head. Yeah, composure. Yep, level head. Um, that's that old Bennett factor. If you were to if I was to pick them. I probably wouldn't because I've only seen. He's been a couple of good ones. Yeah, but yeah. I wouldn't pick off just one. You'd need to. You want to see more of it. Yeah, more of a yeah. decent season. You're definitely on the f- in the fault in the frame. Yeah, especially yeah. if we one of the halves go down. Mm. Yeah. Also, just is his mic high enough? Sometimes it isn't. Oh, you try that. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's maybe. better. Yeah, cool. Yeah, Don't want to. That's better. We bro. actually want to hear you. Um, yeah. Next question, bro. Jordan underscore Leaf. Jordy. What? Where do, where do you think the Warriors are going wrong? Well, clearly they're, just, they're not winning, not scoring enough points. Well, not winning, <laughs> yes. that's f- <laughs> <laughs> Now, yes, I think that's correct. Um, I said it most weeks. Probably variation, eh? I mean, in the weekend, though. Yeah. Obviously, two, way too many errors. Yeah. yeah, a couple of errors in there. Two, three. <laughs> Maybe <Four>. more. <laughs> what do you reckon, Hums? Yeah, I think... Uh, there's a factor. There's a few few combinations of things. Um, obviously, I I still actually have faith in Webby. Like, oh, to for what he done last year, and he's obviously still sticking with the process. There's no changes. You, I've seen the yeah. lineup today. Like, unless you're injured, you're out. But well, you see, um, what I would, and I think we've spoke about this, is just just a couple of trick shots where they do go to the left edge. Um, Get Roger in. Even well. if it's only once a game, <laughs> you know, like a, just a late cut behind the ruck back to to Mighty. Just every ten, eh? Just give the look. just just give the I don't know, but obviously Webby's got something going on there, and they've. But yeah, I I think just a little bit more Do variety, reckon? one or two. They're just gonna go right, go right, go right, and just hopefully get nail a few games, get the wins. Come finals time, we go left, and teams don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe that's it. Um, yeah, obviously our handling and discipline was shocking in the weekend. Yeah. I just feel like you need to like defend really well for that game plan too. Yeah. Like you can't let in that many points and have that yeah. game plan. Plus, also you need the refs to do their job, but we won't. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, That's well. I also think the weekend, especially playing on a heavy 10. Yeah, we were um, saying that, yeah. Spreading the ball, trying to trying to get those, you know, those double block yeah. play right up to the wing. But the Knights were just, they were, they were already understood what was happening before yep. we even got mm. the ball to that second link. Yeah. I, I don't know. I just I hate wet weather footy, but I think it should have been one of those days where it was just roll the sleeves up. And I think the Knights done that well, eh? Yeah, 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 definitely. Like, yeah, they hardly ever got. They were doing none of those block plays. Yeah. No, With Eden, just too wet. Mitch, mm. Tom Ali, all those boys, just run it straight, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and just it's, you know, it's just not going to be for entertainment. Like we got to win games in the wet. It's pretty much just and on either side of the ruck, you know, and just don't yep. try and yeah. push it too too hard on the edges because it's just. Like we were saying that day, eh? Like quite often they're giving the pass at the line mm. in wet. Like here you go. Oh yeah, coming on those short balls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like, like real, real flat on the line, and like we were saying on a on a nice dry track, you still it's hard to catch those balls, let alone on a yeah on a day where everyone was dropping balls left, right, and centre. So yeah, I reckon yeah. there's just should have been a lot more scoots out of dummy just working around that ruck. Do you um think because. There was all that talk about Wade Egan making blue squad, and since then he's gone pretty quiet. Do you reckon he's just gone quiet so he doesn't get picked? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I wish. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> be good for us. I, I, I reckon people have just studied us, and yeah. Yeah. he has not done a show and go <laughs> since he started the comp dominating. You know, he was yeah, doing he was doing that all the time, yeah. They're already just 
Yeah, they're just honing in, and I think yeah, I think it's more the other teams, eh? Doing their homework on us, bro. Yeah, m- yeah. Which isn't hard because we've been a little bit of a one-trick pony for a while. <laughs> All right. Okay, Timo Brookie. Timo, Junior Kiwis 2014 team. Who has kicked on well from the squad? We'll send photo. Oh yeah, so go to um. No, I have to go to his messages. Let's what it might bring up there. His messages. Oh, what a good partai from our uh, friend. Very diligent Demo. partai. Demo. Utimo. No. All right, name that team then. Okay. Number one, Cody Nakarima. Oh, Kicking on quite well. Number two, Chance Penny. Oh, another chance. Yeah. Um, three, Tane Moon. Four, Watson. Okay, there's a few moulding names in that in here. <laughs> <laughs> Watson Hileta. Sam Manulilua. Six, Timaiti Martin. Seven, Zach Docker Clay. Eight, Sam Lee Swanee, vice captain. Manaya Cherrington. He's one that got away, yeah. He was quite good. Captain. Adam Fanua Blake, might have heard of him. Mm. Joseph Tarpane. Uh, 11, 12, Nelson Asafa Solomon, and 13, Josh. Wow. And then. Aluai, the bench. 14, Danny Levi. 15, Lamar. Leo Levave. 16, Braden Ueli. 17, Adam Tuomavavi Gerard. Tuomavavi. Good to see that name. All right. Um, obviously, the Fords is obviously, there's a few that stand out right there. Outstanding Fords. Aiden, Joseph Tarpany, and then Nelson, obviously. Jesus. Even love old Sam Lasoni. He was good for Sam us. Sam Lasoni, he was good. But if I was going to pick three, those would be the three for me. What about you guys? Oh, has he asked for, to ask for us? His top three, three that have kicked oh. on. Did he? Is that what he said? Was that the question? No, he, he's the same. Who... What's your thoughts, I think, and who's kicked on? Who's your three that have kicked on? That's all he said. Let's mm. see. We'll go back. I see you know your questions well. well. <laughs> Get your hand off my question. <laughs> um, who has kicked on well from the squad? Oh, sorry. If you go to the actual, sorry. I'm pretty sure it's in the actual. Um, At what he just sent before? Yeah. yeah. Sorry. Technical failures. Oh, yeah. Three most impressive careers that have kicked on and three that haven't. Well, there's a few people I don't know. So that those ones. <laughs> so yeah, I'll probably start them. with Watson, Helita, Sam, Manu Lilua. Don't really know who they are. Chance mm. Penny, haven't heard of him either, really. Um, but the three standouts for me are Adam Fanor Blake, Joseph Tarpany, and Nelson Asofa Solomona. Yeah. If I was to pick one, it'll be old Tarps. Mm. Yeah. Um, Tarpany. Absolute machine, workhorse. Absolute hissa. Handle. I'll chuck in. To Mighty, just because he went through that whole yeah. brain, oh brain, brain. What a journey, eh? What a yeah. journey. And then to actually on. come back, man, Out, outrageous yeah. journey. Outrageous. All right, good question, mate. Thank you, Timo. Very diligent. Um, Very diligent. Appreciate that, man. Okay, that Timo done. Now, what you all been waiting for? Oh yes. So we put it out there on the line, asking for the look, rugby league lookalikes of all the, all the panelists. From the group of the Kiwi NRL podcast boys. And uh, they came in thick and fast. <laughs> they came in thick and fast. Yeah, there'll be some stitch-ups. There'll be some absolute stitch-ups. But okay. who was first, Jason? Jason was first. All right, read them out. Oh, J-Dub. Look graphic tees. This is about me, by the way. This is Jason. So look we're talking about Jason yeah. look yeah. A wish version of Luke Metcalf. A wish? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. A- accurate. Accurate. <laughs> Humueta. And under the weather, Jason Nightingale. <laughs> <laughs> that Kiwi punner. Reed, Mah- uh, Reed Mahoney, yeah, grub. <laughs> Reed Mahoney? Yeah. Reed Mahoney, oh yeah. Um, Matt underscore Con- Consit? Consit, what's, Cons- up? what's up? What's up, my boy? Connie? That's Consit. A young Consit. A Joe Dirt. <laughs> Obviously, he missed the brief, but it's accurate. <laughs> he might have played a bit of rugby league in his day, Joe Dirt. Maybe. Um, this one's from Lenny. Andrew Webster, if he was homeless and was on crack. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Timo, Jaden Campbell, I've had that before. Oh, yes, yes. He also said Cam McInnes, 52nd hottest guy in the game. Apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently he be- <laughs> beat out some archies. He beat, up a lot, beat out a lot of people. I'd be, yeah. I'd be filthy if I was below Cam McInnes. Yeah. Joel Mitchell. <laughs> <laughs> What's Big Joel he got on there? Oh, J-Dubs. Lance O'Hire's autistic J-Dubs. son. Lance O'Hire's autistic son. That's, a, that's quite <laughs> creative. Aish, Wade Egan. You'll like that. Yeah. Need, a, need a few more tattoos, though. 
Yeah. A couple and more injuries. A few more injuries. <laughs> and a bit more quad. Quad now, def. Richie Hamiorda? Hami, Hamiorda, Ham- yeah. Kia ora, Richie. Kia ora, I, don't know, Richie. I, I don't know if he's meaning Wayne Bennett, but he said the dude from the Finns. Dwayne Bennett, yeah. <laughs> Dwayne Bennett. <laughs> That's his name. The guy, the Finn guy. Oh, is that what he actually means? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you do actually kind of look like him. True. You know, like, you know, do you know who he is? No. And it's like the Finns kind of, their version of the Mount Smart. I guess, oh. you might, I guess you might better chuck it up for the viewers and the listeners. But um, we'll just quickly have a, have a quick look. Let's just it? put Dwayne. Dwayne Bennett. Dwayne Bennett in there. It actually sounds familiar now. Don't tell me his name's actual Dwayne Bennett. Who is it? He's given himself that name, surely. He has. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I've seen his videos. Go to images, bro. Yeah, I'll go to images. Yeah. Clear that bloody, clear that. <laughs> search what the hell's that? Do you reckon? What do you reckon? Surely, yeah. it's a bit of Jace. Yes. Oh yes, yes. Got a bit yes. of the moolay going on too. Oh, he's yes. he's the fins up, brother. Yes, he's crack up, Jake. He's a comedy Jake. Ooh, brother, what's that? Um, JP, 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 maybe JP Slidge, Scott Minto, Scott Minto, um, Liz, Buzz Ruff, Ruff, <laughs> oh. Now that's um quite accurate. Oh, and also Peter Sterling. <laughs> <laughs> Peter Sterling. <laughs> The bro's got pretty silly. Oh, when he was playing, though, he had it here. Um, the WRL Mole, Jamal Idris. Jamal Idris. <laughs> <laughs> Very interesting. I was expecting to get that myself. <laughs> um, and then the, from the bro, Nick, Matt Lodge from Wish. Oh, that's M- definitely must, accurate. Be, must be the here, eh? That's definitely accurate. <laughs> yeah. Oh, like, I just ordered this Matt Lodge off Wish, turns up. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Is this an uh, Asian sizing? <laughs> Okay. Oh no, yes, who's next? So are those all yours done? Yep. yep. Some great guesses, guys. There was a uh, good interaction there and a lot of accurate ones too. Yes. Jamal Idris, I don't know about that, my curse. <laughs> um <laughs> you might have clicked on the wrong person. <laughs> Look graphic tease. This is for Lenny, by the way. Okay. Alright, so we're doing Lenny. RTS. Oh. <laughs> Aye. Aye. <laughs> oh no, I suppose. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Um Eyebrow bumps of doom, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, bro. <laughs> Sad Jagger. Sad Jagger. Have you noticed, though? <laughs> take the, yeah, yeah. yeah. We don't say it, though. Just take the Cuzzy's physique, at least. <laughs> Christ. Hamueta. The whole Lebanon squad. Yep, accurate. The Kiwi Punter. Do you want to read out the one <laughs> from Kane? What does it say? Read it, bro. Mele Hufunga. <laughs> 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 Fuck yeah. Oh. Um, Sad to Mele, man. Ray Nick. Oh, I do this every time. Nikawali. Jo- Joey to- uh, Tapini. Yeah, I can see a bit of Joe there. Um, I said, "Fui, fui, moi, moi." <laughs> <laughs> Big fooey. Um, you said about yourself, actually, Lenny. Dill Brown. Oh, random. <laughs> <laughs> random. Eh? And Jermaine Asako. <laughs> oh, what random? <laughs> That's weird. That's out there, bro. Timo, Nathan Kalis. Nathan Kalis. Nathan Kalis. Say less. I'll take it though. I guess champion. Um, Joel Mitchell, Robbie Farrell. Oh, that's probably a good one. Yeah, that's Robbie Farrell. That's pretty yeah. good. He's got similar beak. Aish. Similar bleak. Must be the favourite brother. Sh- Sean Johnson. Yeah, I've had that before. <laughs> Multiple yeah, see a bit times. Of, bit of Sean there. And then Richie Hummy, um, Hummy Order to Mighty Martin. Oh, mate, Man. people are just being too nice. <laughs> that JP. Yes, that's just follow up, man. Reese, Reese Wesser. Reese Wesser. <laughs> <laughs> that's more like <laughs> Stacey Jones Rugby League. Reese, Reese Wesser, I'll take it. Reese Wesser. Les from Les, Nick Meany. Nick Meany. <laughs> Meany. The jerk, yeah. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> what? <laughs> Another one from Les. Anthony Minicello's uh, nose. <laughs> <laughs> that was the other brother, wasn't it? I oh, know. Man, Les put heaps in for you. Jeez, mate, what do you have to? What's he got next? <laughs> you <can> so see <laughs> for Telekoi. Jeez, <laughs> mate. Kenny Bromwich, yeah, I can yeah, see that. Let's see All right, that. Kenny Bromwich. Yep. The WRL Mole, Normie. So, Corey Norman. Chair, bro. Nick N. Carrick, Benji Marshall from Timu. <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty Classic. good. All right, who Those are next? all Lenny's. Cheers, guys. All right, next we got the Mr. Rawuri Gillard. James Fisher-Harris from... Look, look graphic tees. Oh, he's, he's been too nice. Oh, I guess he's got, the, he's got that kind of... <laughs> he's got that demeanour. Uh, hearty, yeah, hearty Got a look. bit of that demeanour, yes. Chuck a young goatee on the bro. Um, <laughs> Philip... Philip Ratama? 
Ratima, Philip D. Ratima. Yep. Uh, George Rose. Georgie. No. Oh, Big Georgie. Georgie. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the Kiwi Punter. What a move, Greg. <laughs> That's a good one. All right, all right. Needs a bit of the mud flap. They talk all. Greg Eastwood. This is oh, coming yes. from Richie NZ. Yeah, I see a bit of, bit of Greg, Greg Eastwood in it. Big George here. Uh, Ravalawa. Ravalawa? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Richie Hamiota, Levin from Waz Up TV. Okay. Le- Levin, Levin. We'll need to see a matchup to see that. This one's accurate. Uh, Nariana uh, Tuki. Tuki? Yeah, he's bit of, got a bit Tukes. of Tuki about him. What about the horries that that's behind him? He must he must be in the picture. <laughs> what this look? Yeah, Random. Leo Thompson. What else have we got there? Russell Packer. Russell Packer. Yeah, you can see a bit of that. What a legend he was. From Les Sam Cassiano. People just naming like New Zealand props. Third triplet of Leo and Tyrone Thompson. Not Actually, a bad I shot. do see Leo Thompson and a bit of them and him. Eh? Not a not a bad shot. Tanned. <laughs> <laughs> a tanned Mark O'Mealy Ogre <laughs> That's a, ogre. a tanned Mark O'Mealy That's 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 probably the most accurate one Might be the winner Or that one. there's the um, obvious Balance Balance to Fuddy Balance <laughs> to Fuddy So those are all uh, Rawoodies Some good ones there team Sorry Andre I got that off your LinkedIn It's the only photo I could find He looks bloody professional Very professional So Dre's up next Look graphic tees D- DWZ with shirt With short hair Dylan White, didn't he? Oh, I guess so, I guess so. I've just thrown in Zane Titavano. Ah, yes, Tokoroa. From Tokoroa. Nuts. Faria Oriri. Faria, faria Oriri. Can look like whoever he wants, just as long as he's wearing a Tipamu kit doing it. TPU. <laughs> Tipamu? Shout out to Tipamu. Shout playing, out to Tipamu. <laughs> playing those boys back in the day. RT. It was scary, actually. It was my I think, first, um, is that first year are Benny Matt's in them involved with them now? Not sure. Might be Russell Packer, as one of them is. Oh, yeah. Um, Good old Tapamu. Um, Ran Koali. Rani Koali. Uh, CNK. He'll take that. This He'll is accurate. That. Nathan Merritt, coming from the <laughs> Kiwi Punter. Nathan Merritt. He's got. He's dropped some gems, all the Kiwi Punter. From uh, my boy next door, Paul Fatuera. Paulie it's Fats. A, yep. It's a bit like him, eh? Timo, Isaac, John. Go on here from Matt Penny. Fitu Taiwa. Fitu Taiwa, that rings a bell, but I can't it remember what he um, You just can't look it up for us, my boy. Oh, Fitu. How do you spell really? it? Really? T A E. Oh, that one. Fitu yep. Taiwa. Is he a rugby league player? Oh, oh yes. Yeah? Oh, uh, yes. Oh, you see, you know your Fitu's well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was on the. That was, on, that was a great kit, too, that jersey. Yes, it was. 53. Really, 89, did Mike Pedal play rugby league? <laughs> <laughs> Mike Pedal, mortgages. Mike Pero. No, is it? Oh, isn't Mike Pedal the guy that was on the edge in that? Ah, oh, that's Mike Peru. Mike oh, Peru. Mike, yeah. Mike Pero, Pero mortgages. mortgages. Yeah, well, that's what I thought. And then I was like, I've never seen Mike Pedal. But we're <laughs> saying it right, but he never used to pronounce his yeah. name correctly. Craig Polamounder. That's coming <laughs> from someone. <laughs> There's Danny Levi, Paul Kent. You know, Paul Kent, he's okay. got a lot of Paul Kent about him. Yeah, he does. I've he seen does. him try to scrap someone before. Did, did you? <laughs> Andre, yeah. Oh, Christ. Took on a tree or two. Calm it down, Dre, jeez. Supposed to be bloody inspiring the people these days, mate. The WL Mole, not sure, but could pass as a referee's boss in this photo. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when I seen that comment, I was like, I could I, oh, I could see him in the doing yeah. the bunker. Yeah. Okay, let's go back a couple yeah. clips. Yep. Um, oh, that's something to add to your CV, Dre. Could be in that in that bunker, mate. We need someone up there with a bit of bloody know-how. Could do a better job, Christ. I reckon. Okay, Brilli eighty nine. One oh, of the one ouch. of the water boys. Look, graphic tees. <laughs> one of the water boys, you reckon, for Brilli? <laughs> we got another Mark Tukey. Mark Tukey. <laughs> you got Clinton Gutherson <laughs> from your boy here. <laughs> He'll love that. He's got a lot of Clint Gutherson about he him. Does, he yeah. does. Yeah. Chris Heinington, yeah, I like that. Oh one. yes, That's Chris Heinington, yes. Yeah. Thank you, Tamo. Ash has given him a jazz to Vanga. Jazz to Vanga. Have you seen jazz before, G? <laughs> Aisha clearly. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Nah, shout out Aisha. Shout out Aisha. Thank you though. Thank you. Um, JP Solich. I hope that's right. Darius Boyd. Oh, he'll like that. He'll like that. Brett, <laughs> Brett Finch. Les McElroy. That's a bloody good one. Brett Finch. 
gets up to the same bloody sort of things in his, in his bloody spare time too, bloody I reckon. Dirty dog. Les McElroy, Cam McInnes. Cam McInnes has got yep. a couple more teeth in him, but yep. Yep. Chris Butler, unshaven after a week-long bender. <laughs> Chris, Chris Butler's the ref, isn't he? I Chris think so, Butler, yeah. Is that yeah. Ring a bell? Google him, though. I think it is. <laughs> unshaven. WR, uh, the WRL mole. Waikato Rugby in League with, mole. Yes. Coming in with some bloody beauties. If you want to keep up with the uh, Waikato Rugby League competition, follow the bro. That's Chris Butler. Oh, oh that, yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah, he's a pain in the butt too. That's re- he's really thought outside the box too. Yeah, well mm. done. That's that's pretty good. And he's got the same smile. Same smile. But he's just unshaven. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's great. Love your work. I probably didn't have go. too much on it, Mahi, today, intru- obviously. Reading my own, this is, oh no, this is Timo, this is good. This is Timo, yeah. Look, graphic tees, Rico Ioane. Yeah, <laughs> she looks <laughs> like that, eh? <laughs> 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 Big Tino on crack. <laughs> <laughs> Sol, uh, from Nikuali, uh Solomon. Eli Malo. Malo. Yes, yeah, he's seen the story too. I've seen he's seen. The Kiwi Panther, Edric Lee. Thank you for sending that. Edric Lee, that's accurate. Edric Lee. Zane, Lenny, Zane Tirav, Tirav, uh, Tiravano, if he stopped doing weights and eating. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Fatuera. Oh, another Paulie Fatuera. From Petey McKenzie. Justin Ollum, that's yep. That's great. Yep. Probably doesn't have the traps, but Patrick Arvan. Oh, Petty Arvan, that's a throwback. Joel Mitchell, Jerome Luai. He's got a few options here. <laughs> Joel. Kurt gets even slid old Kurtley Beale in there. Kurtley Beale. <laughs> he's got Sailor. <laughs> he's, he's going through <laughs> the wall now. He's got this is all from Joel. <laughs> and he's got also Lottie Takeri. Takeri. Aisha's got Tohu Harris. <laughs> J- JP Sledge, I don't know how to say your name, sorry, but Richie Barnett on the pipe. There's a lot of on the pipe on the crack <laughs> comments. He was pretty lean in this he photo. He was pretty lean in that photo. It's probably the leanest he's ever been. Another, Just, another Justin Ollum. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, yes, another good Omar one. Omar Slomanko. From Les. Thank you, Les. Yeah, that's Les. a good one. Omar Slomanko. Normies lookalikes lookalike. <laughs> <laughs> Last, right. For, right. for, for Timo or even you, you could, there could be a Henry Oh, Pien- 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 oh yeah, Henry same Pien- physique too. Yes. Yeah, that's a that's yeah, a, that's, a, that's a good one for us. We could put him in that group, that group photo of us three. Right, here we go. This is me <laughs> now. Hamuera. Bush version of CNK. LOL. Thanks, thanks, mate. <laughs> Clemmer in the hair days. <laughs> <laughs> Clemmer with hair, he reckons. <laughs> Don't know about that. Matt Connie, you're a good man. I reckon the bro's Sonny Bill Williams. Oh, this is a stitch up. That's the brother-in-law. Bex, is that Sonny? <laughs> Shit, is that Sonny Bill Williams? Oh, it's another stitch up. I didn't ask him to do this. The sister in law. Did you get Sarah any work done today? <laughs> or are you just messaging everyone saying nice shit out? <laughs> oh, there's going to be some beauties. And Sarah Gifford. Thanks, guys. I appreciate that. Sonny Bill Williams as well. That's definitely, you put that in the family chat. <laughs> I haven't, man. Straight <laughs> up. Sonny, it's a, Sonny will be loving that. Reese Wesser. I knew this was You got Reese Wesser as well. Chris Sandow. Oh, yep. He's that's the a man, good one. old Chris. Shannon Walker. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uppy oh, Kurosawa up, Uppy I'll take Uppy He's mean Stacey Jones Thanks That's Aisha Pre or post playing Just asking Jamie Soward <laughs> <laughs> Jamie Soward Yeah it's a good one Head Big Nelson Body Jaden Campbell <laughs> This is from Les <laughs> Les has obviously Had a lot of spare time today Yeah I've seen you in your In your van Bloody on your phone bro That's what you're doing all day WR Mole Unmoustached Joe Chan Oh from the storm Oh yeah I can <laughs> see that actually you used to rock him out a bit. Hori's 32. Last name starts with S and rhymes with Pandal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming that's Chris Sandow. And Danny Boy. Shout out to Danny Boy. Good to see you listening, mate. Or, or follow us. Um, Dallin Watini with short hair. I reckon you could be oh, a, yeah. um, back in your days when you were hitting the clubs. Be a young Spencer Lenu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Even a bit of a... Brent Weir was a common one. Yeah, Brent Weir was, yeah. Nowhere near the same chest, but pretty chest similar looking. Actual pics of doom, eh? <laughs> the bro was a walking chest. He was a walking and <laughs> running chest, man. How good. Oh, that's right. Thanks, everyone. Thanks, everyone. Sent it through. It was a good little game to play. Um, a few questionable ones, especially for me. No, I was actually treated quite nicely, so I appreciate that, guys. Um, next segment Jason, preview. <laughs> they didn't hear me whisper it. They'll get a fright in the car though because I like, had it up too high. Yeah. 
Alright, cheer my Maoris, cheer my tokos, cheer my usos, cheer my kai, cheer my kiha brothers and sisters, cheer my Lebanese brothers and sisters, cheer to everyone. Namaste, my brothers. Namaste. Succulent Chinese meal. First game <laughs> of the round, what was it, Jason? Rabbitohs host the Panthers and it goes to Panthers 42 12. Yeah. Thoughts on the game? Quick out the blocks, Rabbitohs. Yeah, a couple quick tries. But like a quality thoroughbred, Panthers let down late. They done their best work late, and they ended up thumping them. Um, there was a yellow card at the start, wasn't there? Yes. Um, was that for a hip drop? I so Isaac, yeah, Isaac Targo got yellow. Oh, ten minutes in the bin. Just came back on, and then Jai Arrow got done. Oh, yes. and then also Jacob Post at the end. Yes, I see. I see. Um, thoughts on the game, guys? Um, Kiwis that stood out to you. Weren't many in the Rabbitohs team. Um, I reckon Fish was really good, actually. He was uh, as effective at his effective best. Yeah, bring him to yeah. the Wars, man. That'll be handy. Oh, wait, he is coming. Um, and I think he was very, um, what's the word? You know, he's just always the same sort of level A, like. Yeah, 100%. Brings the same game every week. But uh, what was the stats, bro? So, 22 runs for 100. 80 metres, 61 post contact. Shit. Two shit. tackle breaks. Me now. Me now. 27 tackles, zero missed. Holy shit. Well, great outing then. I'll take it back. Then he played very well. No, I thought he stood out for me. Um, Moses. Moses Liotta. What Tw- stats did we get for uh, the bro? 20 tackles, one missed. Three tackle breaks for 11 runs and 90 metres with 31 post contact. Oh, that's not too bad either. How much did he play? 35 minutes. 35 minutes. Oh, a bit reduced time. Well done, Moses. For Morsese. Uh, Scotty's still not back, obviously. Scotty too hotty. I think they're missing him a bit. Um, but yeah, that's just pants. That's just pants. Well, Rabbitohs are going absolute. We're b- got any Kiwis on that rapity? No, Kyle. Uh, Kyle Tani Kyle. Milne, if he's not suspended. Have you seen the team they named this week? He's quite a, uh, it's like quite a trial a match team. They've oh got shit. so many injuries. Who's that, the rapity? Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, my, oh, my. Christ. Uh, but yeah, Panthers, shit. Even yeah. with no Nathan Cleary yeah. there. Four peat. Oh, fuck, I reckon. It's looking mm. that way, bro. Christ. Early in the year, they don't have Nathan Cleary, and they're still doing that. And they've been winning, even, in, you know, sometimes not the best way, but they just know how to win. It doesn't matter. Mm. And it's, it's just ridiculous. Like the great Dominic it Toretto said. It truly is. Whether it's by an inch or a mile, winning's winning, man. Mm. <laughs> mm. Um, but what they're doing is that they keep to their um, plan. Yeah, but and they, they don't change up. It's like what we're trying to do, but we're not executing but they, it. But yeah. they they just keep to it, keep to it. Eventually, they're going to wear down the team. And the yep. And like like I said earlier, you know they'll they'll come home with a wet sail every game. Yep. All right, next game: next game. Eagles versus the Raiders. Holy shit! Twenty four to twenty six to the Raiders. What a game, lads! So yep. now, with now the Eagles were ahead quite convincingly at half time, weren't they? Oh yes, twenty. Yes. Twenty to six or something like that. Was yeah, it? Yeah. But it was a dominant. Yeah, it, was. it was a, was dominant, a dominant looking showing. first half, man. Like it was like it was to nothing, right? Oh, I think they got that little oh, try before. Yeah. Kayo. Yeah, because yeah, from the mad flick pass from Whitehead. That could have gone the other way too, though. That yeah. could have been a. He, yeah. he intercepted the little thing to Tommy. I just mm. missed on a missed out on a seven hundred dollar multi on this game. Oh. Unlucky. Yeah. Right. My buddy. Um. Great game, guys. But great game. Raiders come back with the bounce back. Um, how good are their uh, young half, halves? A little pairing there. Yeah, big yeah. Me- special mention on with Kyo and um, Stranger. Strange. Strange. Ethan Strange. Those two are starting to look like a pretty um, good little combux. Yeah, they're only young men, but look like they very young. They look pretty well established and mm. both eligible for Kiwis, I believe. So um, if they swing that way, that'll be yeah. We're good to know some great info behind Kyo and if Stranger will. Uh, yeah, w- can you go to the uh, inner inter- alpha legions? And just check their um just check where they're born at least. Co papa, bro. Um, because yes, because his dad coached the Maldives team, didn't he? Yes. Woman's Maldives team. I it's mean a pocket Strangers. rocket, bro, so much energy, man. Birthplace. Sydney, New South Wales. Oh mm. no, Kayo. Yes, that's but a he's, Maori, But he's Maori. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you know. He might Where was he born? Sydney. 
No, that's in... Um, that's down bloody... That's down, that's down, down the down line. The ways. No, that that's down the line, isn't it? That's um, Next just up. out of Hastings. Yeah, Danny, <laughs> around Danny Verk. Yeah, yeah, Danny Verk by Sydney. Um, or Taitahi well, there. Strange is Kiwi, <laughs> but he was also born in New South Wales. Oh, no, that's... Same, same that's Sydney, bro. Same that's just Sydney. out of Danny Verk. We just said that. <laughs> you know, by bulls. <laughs> <laughs> you know where bulls is there, bro? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, yeah but, no, my heart am I. Have you ever seen uh, bulls? <laughs> <laughs> Have you got a set? <laughs> I can show you bulls in a second if you want. Um, no, nah, but in all seriousness, yeah, those two halves for me were real, mm. you know, and level-headed. Chris had a mean game, Sebastian. I was just about to say, out of the Kiwis in that game, um, mm. Sebi Chris. Seb Chris looked very good. He's putting his hand, he's getting back to where he was. 16 runs for 206 metres, 85 post-contact. He's a big boy, he's a big lad. What about the, the mooks? Uh... He was doing a bit of more like hard mahi, wasn't 14 he? 14 runs for 117 metres, 43 post contact. Oh, it's still pretty solid, though. Eight tackle breaks, though. Sebastian and Chris, three tackle breaks. Eight tackle breaks for the Moko. Yeah. One offload from two. Madness. And four tackles, zero miss from Sebastian and Chris, and then 13 tackles with a few missed from No him. Joey Manu. You're probably going those two centres, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, 100%, man. Because who else is there? Roger. I reckon he'll go... Hasn't come boy, out yet. Boy, boy, bear. But he hasn't said yes to playing for New Zealand either. He's but, been very cool. But he's not, he's not even on the fence because he hasn't said anything. That means you're on the fence. <laughs> I think Rocco Berry on the should, fence. Be in the, Fuck off. should also be in the, be in the, the pool there. Um, and you've got... Who else is there? Remus like, Smith. Yeah, Rem, he's actually playing well. He's there's, getting back up there. Um, there's even the lots of, like, if we had so many second rowers, there's even lots of Marata who can he's play He's played there before, as correct. Well, so yep. there's probably a bit of a pool there, which is exciting. You know? Very exciting. Very exciting. But uh, shout out to, to Big Sticky, Angry Ricky uh, Stewart. He's got so many Kiwis in his roster. It's Doesn't mind a Kiwi and a Pommy. Nice. It's nice. It's, yeah. yeah that's, that's then then you don't lose him at Origin. Yeah. Well, that's it. Yeah, it's a big part. If you get a real good English and Kiwi players, you don't lose him over Origin. Nice the Kiwis, man. Tarpenny. Tarpenny just being Tw- himself. Yeah, 23 tackles, yeah. Couple, only a couple missed, two tackle breaks. 16 runs for 161 metres and 62 post contact. Wow, we. Mm. Wow, we. He. Outrageous. All right. Um, no one really in the Seagulls team, is there? Nah. Seagulls, what's nope. up? Do you reckon have red? They're a bit they're odd to like try and get a line on, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Do you reckon they're top? We have them finishing. Oh, I have them up the top somewhere. Just just for what, Brooks. Sixth. Oh, top, yeah, yeah. Top yeah. 16. I see them definitely. I see them <laughs> definitely in the eight. No, they've just they've got some good players in the right places. Having Brooks and Cherry yeah, Evans been as your real good, eh? I feel like they're like us at the moment. We're real similar teams, like mm. we can. Yep. Well, we drew with them, so that makes sense. Yeah, Raiders, though, get back after getting absolutely pumped in the poo hole. Last okay, week. next game. What doing here? Broncos, Rooters, forty to the Roosters, eighteen to the Broncos. You saw that coming. Sam was very chirpy. Very chirpy. He was up and about. But hey, Broncos had a lot of injuries. We did say last week, though. Um, this would be a test to see if the Roosters from last the week before were, mm. yeah. you know, was that going to be the same again? Hundred points in two weeks, crazy. Insane. But that, everyone's had them down to be able to do that. Um, yeah, there's there's never been question about their roster. Eh? Like they've always had the players. But he's not Kiwi, but how gangster has Angus Crichton been? Very good. Is mm. that mongrel? Cheryl May's good. I mean, they've got a good forward pack, and they've got Spencer Lenny coming back. When is it this week? Yeah, and yeah this week. Um, Hargreaves didn't play. Yeah, because he's got his three hundredth this week. Oh, no. Nice. Why did they set him out so he could have his 300 at home? I think that it was pretty much that, but they're like, hey, we'll rest you this week. Against, we're just playing the Broncos. Got a, got a, little, got a little niggle, rest you this week. 300 game. Nice, all right. Any other Kiwis? Still out? Obviously, Joseph Manu. Oh, he's all right, I guess. He's still, every. it's probably the most consistent year he's had, eh, hey, you reckon? Mm. And he's gapping it. One try, 10 runs for 101 metres, 34 post contact, one line break, six tackle breaks. Six tackle breaks. Three offloads, 21 tackles, four missed. All good, bro. He had that mad try to your off um, Dominique Young. Talking yeah. about chests. Chestuses. Chestuses. Brandon Smith is getting to his best again. Uh, I think he's definitely showing that he's... Which I prefer him not playing a whole 80. The yeah. little experiment they were trying yeah. to do with playing him the whole time. Yeah. Well, he only played 22 minutes this game because he got injured, though. He did get injured. Okay. But he's, he's got a good little one, too, with Connor Watson. They're a good little exchange. Yep. Yeah, Connor Watson's a good player. Yeah, is that Xiao S- Wong? What's he? He's Chinese. He's eligible for New Zealand, yeah, Fiji, USA. in China. Oh, and right. Tonga. Wow, I think. Bit of a UN, if you will. 
the no Fahu White. Yeah, so he fun. played for New Zealand A, and he's been good actually coming off the bench. He's, he's good, bro. I like him. Got a bit about him, eh? Mm. Bit about he, him. He actually got the nod to start this week when um, Hargreaves was pulled out, I think. Oh, yeah. He's solid, bro. The young bull gets a, cha- gets a, gets a chance in the starting team. Yeah. Uh, Broncos, I guess the Arthurs, man, come on. <laughs> trying, to, trying, trying that big hit, eh? Trying to put that big hit on like, really early on. It kind of stitched. Like, obviously, he's one of the. He's a good player, Jesse, but. Broken draw. Maybe just, you know, dial that back a little bit. <laughs> Smashed his draw, so. Trying to smoke Dom Young. Um, and then Dean Mariner, did he Dean get Mariner. sent off, eh? Yes, no. he played 70 minutes. Must have. He got sent off, yeah, I think. Yes, he did. Yes, yeah. he did. So That's they're right. under the pump a bit. Uh, I thought Brian Pierre could have from. My eye just watching the game from top of my dome it was a bit quieter that week uh, last this weekend last weekend sorry yeah but Jordan Ricky was as busy as usual I can't remember if it was him but oh no I think Paddy actually went out because normally Pierre Cotter gets moved out to like mm. Mm. center if they have a wing uh, like a outside back go down but Paddy went out there didn't I he? think Paddy went out there from memory weirdly big Paddy Xavier Willison getting thirty eight minutes I don't think he was at his damaging best from memory. Um, Bit of a, yeah, like usually when he comes on, you know, you, t- you can see, you can tell. Um, so, yeah, where to for the Broncos? No Reynolds for a while. Yeah. No Reynolds, no problems or? Yeah, I don't. It's a hard one because they probably need Reynolds to like be dominant. Yeah. But uh, he just keeps getting injured. You almost wonder whether it's uh, whether it's time for the old fella. Well, they've signed him for another year, eh, next year. Did they? Was, Already. That, was that before this? Yeah, <laughs> at the start of the year. <laughs> yep. He's obviously a very ben- he's a very um, influential part of the. I mean, his short game is out the game. Especially the last, and the, oh, he's got the best. He is the best in the game at today. Yeah. See, there was news that Roosters want to target Johnson. Oh, yeah. Don't see him leaving, but he seems yeah. pretty happy in New Zealand. Yeah. Yeah, literally came back because of that. Like, yeah. I'm, so I was like, don't see it happening. I reckon, he'll, I reckon he'll go around the traps again with with big. Um, Fisher Harris on his way. Yeah, I reckon he's got another year in him, surely. One more for the bro. Okay, Nick game. Doggies. Doggies 22, West Tigers 14. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. How many? There's not many Kiwis in the Doggies team. I will say, even Uh, though he's not a Kiwi, but he's kind of like an honorary one. Josh Curran. Yeah. How good is he at front row, eh? (laughs) So, I mean. (laughs) Hum's got um, Simbund. David (laughs) (laughs) Clemmer. Two of them did it. Curious. Yeah. Bit of ill discipline there from the Tigers. Um, they're in games, eh? They just can't seem to. Yeah, it's fast. It must be frustrating, man. I it mean, we're, be, we're yeah. kind of in that little patch at the moment with the Warriors. Yep, similar um, patch. But we haven't been enduring it as long as the uh, West Tigers fans mm. have. So, um, shout out to all the uh, our followers over in Balmore there. Um, I do hope doing you guys it, get doing a win it tough. soon. Hope you get a win soon, mate. We, we know your pain. We just feel your mum, eh? Just not against us, Kiss. Drew Hutchison. Is probably the, like one of the slowest halves in the game. Well, he's not sp- setting any land speed records, is he? <laughs> but <laughs> Bro, he cracks me up. He's <laughs> solid, man. He is solid. He's probably what they need, though. To be fair, because mm. you've got others. You got you Maddie Maddie Burden. You don't need everyone to be super quick. You got Edo yeah. Carr, quick as. As a half, you just want a, a, an organizer, a manager of the game. You know, you don't need to be explosive and hundred percent. Bronson Cherry. If you got that, thanks, six. Helen. Look at the players he's got outside. You got Croydon, Bronson, Sherry, Adekar, Burden. You know, shit. You know, you can be as slow as you like. I, I personally would be looking for an actual established, real good halfback though. Like if I'm oh yeah, Bulldogs. That's, that's not the uh, option, is it? I think it's uh, they are missing. <coughs> it's not the forever option. Yeah, just it's just hard to get halves these days, isn't it? A, a real good one at that day because they did have old Flano went, didn't he? He went over to uh, his dad's uh, club. Yeah, he he's, was, he's going pretty good there. He's kind of looking like he was developing, but... Uh, they, he was getting in and out all the time, eh? Yeah. They couldn't really make a decision. They couldn't, no. Um, was an old Docker Clay there as well? Was he at the Bulldogs? Yeah, last year he's at the Roosters now. Oh, is he? Oh. Um, so we'll go over to the Tigers. Ice Papali'i, 60 minutes. Oh, what happened there? 60 minutes. I didn't actually notice that. Must have come off. Um, once again, copy and paste it from last week and every week. It's doing solid mahi without getting probably the flashy, any mm. of the flashy stuff. Yeah. Um, no Api Kodasol as well, eh, that game? Nope. Uh, any other Kiwis in there? Oh, obviously yeah. our man Solomon Alai Malo. 
backed up a game again. Still pretty solid. A few tackle breaks. I think he's still working and like you know. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing him develop, man, because he was outstanding at Reunion. So takes a while, man. Yeah, look at Willie Warbrick. You know, he took a took a year or two. Took, and you look at him now. You know, you can you can tell he's had a year under the belt, and he's already yeah. he's established. So it's exciting to have him. Then as another winger, up and coming winger. Yeah, hundred percent. All right, next game, Jace. Next game, game that made me feel better about the week before. Titans yes. almost get it done over the yeah. storm. Twenty two twenty. Almost, and they probably should have. Possibly. They're a hard team, man, the Titans, eh? I've watched them real closely because of last week as well. Mm. Yeah. And it's like, yeah, they just look hard to defend. Like, they just throw, yeah, they throw everything at you, eh? Like, all different. Which they've always been able to do. Yeah. Anyone have Fozza for first try? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're Foz. Um, yeah, they're just defending a lot better now, eh? Yep, they just, know? yeah, they hang in, but unfortunately it's... There's Hasler influence, maybe. Um, Kiwi's in there Kieran Foran obviously He's still like He's like in the How good's Kieran? Like he's he's going to run around For another five years It's like a fine wine These older halfbacks man Are really just like Yeah Stepping up man Like There's just a gap between them And then the young people There's no yeah. like um, There's no one in the middle way like Nah that. there's mm. That might be because of COVID And shit too you know Because a lot of those Could be Those weren't playing as much It just There's I a lot of in-betweeners In that kind yeah. of generation eh, Who haven't quite Yep Yep Kicked on and even yeah, but Foz, I think shout out to the bro, keeping his uh, keeping his teen on a ticking, like the, keeping the body going. <laughs> Do you know what cracks me up? The funniest thing about Foz, obviously, he's one of the older players in the game. Yeah. Five point four second play the ball. <laughs> it's not probably the quickest, is it? <laughs> hey, he's old. Well, well, he's got to get he, up and play the ball. That'll take a bit of yeah. Um, yep. but shit, he's playing well. He's unlocked their team. He's definitely unlocked. Yeah. For Fuida. It's just with Fuida. He loves digging into the line, you know. It's and if you've got Fuida outside of me, like yeah, he, and he, you can tell he's always talking. He's always at the boys. Like yep. he just he must be on the field. His presence, yeah, um, hundred percent. You know you can't. Uh, just what you're watching that Warriors game, eh? You can see him, yeah. like, you know, see him leading button. with his actions, yeah, yelling at the lads. Um, Isaac Liu was there. Isaac Liu, well, yep. I think and Aaron Clark also had a hit. Yeah, pretty Aaron good game Cl- too. So Isaac, solid, bro. Isaac Liu, yeah. ten tries, zero missed. Ten Aaron tries. Clark, 24... Oh, 10 tackles, sorry. <laughs> I was like, shit. I, um, Aaron Clark, 24 tackles. Tahi missed. Shit. No, he's solid, bro. Aaron Clark. And he's that's def- 42 minutes. So that's a good little stint, bro. That's what you want. That amount of bench. tackles. When he brings good energy, man. I could see him as a... I guess the Warriors is very good. Oh, yeah. And he looked he looked like a good old, old-fashioned old brick shithouse. Like he solid. was an absolute brick shithouse. Oh, he's put on a bit more weight since he's not playing hooker. Put on some good size, man. I'll be handy for Warriors bench. Christ, that, uh, isn't, uh, <laughs> that isn't math, is it? Christ. Maybe that's who we should have put down. Look in the <laughs> mirror. <laughs> okay. That's about all the Kiwis, eh? Stummy. It is. Willie Woolbrick with a try. Big Willie got a try. He was he was about it too afterwards. He was like, yeah. The brick. <laughs> Remus Smith, also solid. 69 run meters. Nice. <laughs> um, Jerome Hughes, like, mate. I see how here he's out this weekend. Is he? Is he? Pretty sure he is, yeah. I've seen that on a post somewhere. Oh, he's outstanding, man, that guy. I hate playing against him, eh? I yeah, when he plays the Warriors, oh. very, very annoying. Very annoying. Love your work, bro, but just don't play against the Warriors. But, yeah, no, he's definitely, like, one of the best halves in the comp. Easily. Easy, bro. A lot of people put in still saying, oh, he's probably top four, top three. Still. Nah, go on. Go, go on, on now. now. He's the, like, one. A number seven, like Jerome, but there's plenty of good, like, you know, Foz, Sean Johnson, Adam Reynolds. You think about those sevens? But then They don't have the running, like, his running game. He's He's got no. what they've got in... In terms of kick and organising as well. Plus so also the game. His running is like, just, he does. He looks hard to tackle, man. Fast. He is yeah. out. Strong in the hips. Strong in the hips, yep. Tyron Wishart has taken his spot. He's out, all right. With that little car. They don't usually go as well without him. Fellas, well, what do we know about this uh, Sean Bloor? Bloor, is he now, Kiwi? I or? can't tie him down, but I don't think he is. Yeah, I'm going to lock it down. But uh, he's been good. He's he was been. good. Yeah, born in... Came from the Dagers. Born in Sydney, bro. Bloody Sydney. So we good. Oh, so Bull, just by Bulls. Danny. Just by Bulls. <laughs> just down that road. Just down the road, Danny Virk Bulls, Sydney. Well, his auntie, you yes. see, was um, Aroha's friend. You remember? <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a Māori, surely. It's a bit of something. He's oh, wala. Unless he's a... Um, yeah, who knows? But he was good. He, I thought he played well. And Kato's... Oh, I'd say honourable mention. He was in the wild, so he's pretty much Kiwi. Well, he's oh, got yeah. residency. Yeah, yeah. He came on. Hasn't he come on this year? Shit. I knew he would. Oh, well, he, was, he was mean last year. Outside Jar Jar as well. Yeah. 
putting them onto the, through the holes. And then Joe Chan, obviously, we've got Big Nels, 36 minutes off the bench. He's been doing good. Mahi coming back in top grade. How scary is it having Big Nelson on the bench? No, my heart in mind. Oh, I'll sweet. To, I'll oh, sweet. The big boppers are going to go off. This will be easier. Big <laughs> Nelson comes on. Big Nelson, yeah. <laughs> um, also, did we figure out that, was it Alec McDonald was also a Kiwi? Did we figure that out that randomly the other time? Uh, he was born in Auckland. Yeah, bro. Yeah, his nickname's The Chin. That's right. I've seen that. 22. Yeah, so he's, there's a little bit about him. And also Joe Chan. I mean, he's oh, him. that's cool, bro. That's good. Great try-saving tackle from Joe Chan. You remember that? In Who the corner. No. Joe Chan is like a second rower. His dad was Alex Chan, played for the yeah. Kiwis. Joey Chan. Oh, that's good to know. No and his thing. uncle was Jackie, I think. Joe Chan. From no. China? No. Oh, oh, not that Jackie Chan. Racist. So he yeah. was at Super Rugby. Was Alex he? Chan, yeah. Shit. Playing a bit of rugby union. He joins Storm on a two-year contract from the Catalan Dragons after making 12 Super Rugby appearances. Shit. Okay, guys? So he went to Catalan, like, okay, guys? Dragons League yeah. after playing Super Rugby. From Super Random. Rugby, he's, he's done, like, the reverse order, fellas. He's okay? gone from Union. He's okay. gone to France and then come back. All right, next game, Jace. Dolphins get it done. 28 to 26 to the Cowboys. What a cracker. Entertainment. Entertainment plus. Fins up. Fins up. Fins Cowboys up. down. Oh, what about them? They're a bit. Fuck, they're a bit. They're, they're just doing the, what they did last year. I just don't think they're the real deal. Yeah, but I, wouldn't, I wouldn't be putting them in your multi. Tell you who was good though. Griff Neem, I think he had one error though. But shit, he's he's the man, bro. He's playing very well starting. I like him better starting. I said it last week as well. Jason mm. Tomololo coming off the bench. I think that works well for them. Yeah. Um, they don't have many other Kiwis in the old Cowboys team, but yeah. I thought, um, yeah, Griff was really good. Unfortunately, yep. that's why I don't follow you that much there, Cowboys. Yes. Um, also, so the Dolphins, obviously, plenty of Kiwis plenty in there. Plenty of Kiwis. Um, they Dolphins just don't go. know how to say die. No, Jermaine Asako, 20 points, three, three tries, four conversions, five attempts. I'll give you that. 14 runs for 135 metres, 32 post contact, three line breaks. Three tackle breaks. Come on. One offload. Six tackle, two miss. You can do that. It's one of the best wingers in the game. Yeah. What a turnaround in the last two years. Yeah. Oh, it's crazy, man. But it's, then it's recently, crazy. I'm a dicky talkie. Yes. Some of the highlights of him at the Broncos have been coming up on my thing. Bro, when he started at the Broncos, yeah. outrageous. Like he was mean. Made the Kiwis in too. He just had that little spell there. He just went a bit uh, left fuck, old fuck um, Amar, eh? and just, um, But the Broncos were pretty shit at that time. Yeah, too. they were very shit. They, they had a mean team. Post, yeah, yeah, that he, post someone put up. Oh, that Clarkie wooden spoon. Saying, yeah. How did the squad win the wooden spoon? He was in that squad. And it was like, like Haas, Haas, Sack, Fafida, Fafida Junior. Yeah, was, Boyd. No, was it was, he? It was after the Boyd. After the Boyd. What have been just after that? But it was uh, absolutely stacked. Like Carrigan. They're all young back then, but it's yeah. like, that's crazy. They've all kind of split up, most of them, and yeah. they're all just yeah. going mean as now. But Corey Oates yeah. is in the team. Flickler, dead, and... Corey fucking Oates. Farnworth. It was crazy, bro. Um, but yeah, he's mm. come a long way. He's, he's outstanding at the moment. Okay. Cody? Cody. Cody Nicolino. Seven runs for 35 metres. Huh? Random. <laughs> I thought he ran more than that, but he obviously didn't. He could sideways just, run. Was Two line break assist. assists. Oh, he got one taken off him. He had four oh, tries yeah, in the game. Four years. Because yeah. they made a comment about it. Four. We'll say four tries. We'll, we'll keep. We'll give him four. Fuck we'll the NRL. Four, Two tackle breaks. One offload. Fifteen tackles. Three missed. You're good. What a game. He's just. He's building nicely this year. He said he was in the fight for the sixth jersey. He was all up in the air at the start of the year. Mm. I tell you what. He's also born in Auckland. Isaiah Katoa. Is he? He's already played for Tonga, though. Eh? Yep, that's all right, though. You can still play for New Zealand. Born in Lower Hutt. Though, oh, not Auckland. He's born in Wellington. Come on, bro. Lower Hutt. Well, he dug into the. He digs into the line. He's yeah. bloody this year. He's good. Oh, man, he's looking... He's, him mm. and Cody are looking very... Th- they're a bit uh, under the radar sort of <coughs> half pairing, isn't yeah. they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but, yeah, they're coming on nicely. Jesse Bromwich still putting in the decent mahi. What's, I wonder how many years he's dog. got left on Connie. Because this um, is his last year. Is it? Yeah. Fuck, he's, he's, he's almost playing the bit. Like he's playing Reminds so me of Wiki, good. remember Wiki's last yeah, year? Yeah, bro. Just he had a couple him. of years that were a bit, I know he's a legend, but they, was, it, they dipped a little bit. And then yeah. when he kind of knew it was his to last his, year. To his standards. To his standards. He's like, yeah. I, don't need to, I don't need to preserve the body for well, any more it. seasons. And then he just fucking ripped in there. And what did he do, fellas? He yelled out, Sparta. Sparta. <laughs> told you, told you. Jesus. Jeremy Marshall King. Outstanding. He's great. 
47 tackles from the man, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. 45. Oh, 45. 45. Two missed. Come on, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Useless. Not those ones, eh? Absolutely outstanding. Outstanding. He's really, he's the top, tippity top for the Kiwis hookers now. Mm. Be just oh. nice for him to get a full season, man. Yep. It'd be so good to have him playing oh. and then T's coming off the bench. You got Cheese there. You've even got Danny Levi who's found himself back playing consistent in NRL 40. It's it's great. Phoenix Crossland. Phoenix Cross. He does four. He was good on the four. weekend. Kiwi Hooker's right there, bro. Kenny Brom. How you like Kenny that? Brom. He's played Kenny a test Brom. Kenny Brom. If Nui Boy, yeah. <laughs> Kieran, <laughs> Kieran Foran. He'll jump in. Yeah. yeah, he's played. Well, hey, thank God. Thank goodness we're in a position now where we've got just a pool of hookers, eh? Yeah. Really, love, we're really up there for our hooker. hookers, eh? Hooker yeah, standards. Got great hookers. More hookers than bloody Queen Street. <laughs> oh, no, K Road, sorry. All right. Nick game? Mm hmm. Nick game. Uh, Warriors lose. All right, next game. <laughs> 14 to 8 to the Knights. Kiwi standout in that game, guys, for you guys. Kiwi standout. I thought Leo was very good. Um, in the middle there. But from the Warriors, oh, it's kind of hard to pick a standout, isn't it? It just felt like a shit game, bro. It was pretty, I hate, pretty average. All I around. hate heavy 10. It's just, it's hard to really, I don't know, it's hard watching. Like heavy this. 10 at Trentham, it was um, the graveyard. If I was to pick one, I fucking, I, I'm actually struggling. I'd probably, I'd probably stick with Leo. I probably wouldn't pick anyone for the Warriors. From the Warriors, just someone that I thought came on and tried their best. Yes, I know. Tom Ali. Oh, oh, yeah. Yep. He yep. had a lot of, a lot of hisse. I yeah, and I thought the same with Dylan. I thought yeah. Dylan, Dylan was very good. He could come on and just they were trying to bring that energy. Yeah, but, this um, but Tom Ali, thirteen tackles, zero missed. Dylan Walker, twenty eight, zero missed. Shit, good shit. I thought Bunty was good too. Yep, Bunty. We needed that. I mean, we had a bit of bench actually, just, and I saw Mitch Barnett going hard yeah, as, per usual. as per usual. Oh, but he's not a Kiwi. He's so. not a Kiwi, but we yeah. do like we do love our Mitchy. We do like we, the we do we do like a bit of Mitch. I love my big Caucasians. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> um. In that game, Chansey is still 173 metres. Yep. Holy heck. Just the errors. I mean, there's a yeah. lot of errors. I don't really... Do you want to dive into that game? Nah, that? nah. Like, what can we say? I just want to see some structured variation. A little bit. You don't have to change yep. the whole plan. Just, yep. just, 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 just a strike play, one or two. Like, yep. Obviously, the minutes will be nice to see. With the um, disallowed try from the tackle to media, yep. I don't know if it was just missed or whatever happened there. Yep. I was like, okay, that's shit. Everyone reckons it's penalty to try. Extraction, uh, uh, the extru uh, obstruction oh, yes. one, though. Do they need to change that rule? I'm glad you brought that up. Yeah. I made a note of that. <laughs> as, a, as a coach now, you must be telling all your forwards. Just to fall in. If you're a lead runner, you fucking do what you get. You, you dive, dive through out gaps. Of the <laughs> you're sidestepping like you have to not touch a player. Yeah. Even if you think the ball's going to oh, the wing, you out. have to be prepared. It's coming yep. back. Like, you yeah. just keep running. Like, Forrest Gump, you know, just yeah. run. Just <laughs> and I just keep running. <laughs> Even if you brush his lull off, you're still going to get penalised. Yeah. That's crazy. Sort of, yeah. That's absolutely crazy. Like Hastings wrapped his arms around him. Yeah. 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 And then we still... There were so many calls like that over the weekend. I like, made a note of that. Like, yeah. If we got those, not like we sh would have won the game, but technically we should probably shouldn't have won the game because we were shocking. Yeah. Yeah. Like I don't think, yeah. And I think people complaining about that try with Dallin, yes, but I think we've, we cooked it ourselves. Yeah. Before that. If you're relying my, on those calls. My flatmate hit me up. He's like, oh, how do we go? I was like, we played shit. <laughs> we <laughs> went. We went there. We we, 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 we turned up <laughs> to the grounds, but yeah, I just said we, yeah, we had so many errors. We lost the game. We didn't deserve to win, but. Yeah. It needs to be a turning point for the season, though, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. And then, roosters and then Pen Penrith next. And what, what better way to do it? Against Sammy's yeah. Roosters. And the Roosters. <laughs> and it's like. Give it's just the bash. yeah, it's one of those games where it's like you know we didn't get pumped by forty like no it feels it feels like we're you know we're absolutely shit like even these no games good. we only just lost that to be fair and it was, yeah besides the dragons game which was because imagine if we didn't make yeah. the errors in a close game like yeah, that. yeah exactly next game Jace what next was game it? sharks twenty dragons ten nice uh, that was actually a bit of a cucker game actually mm. similar I pissing down I, I didn't actually watch it um, sharks obviously just done enough to win you know how. So opposite to the Warriors, you know, when you're just not quite doing enough to mm. win. Mm. Well, I feel like last year, that's what we did. We'd mm. just do enough just to win. Or yeah, we, we were winning those games. Yeah. yeah, we were winning those games and we're just not finding it at the moment. But hey, I'd rather be trying to find our fit footing now than at yep. the end of the season. Yes, yes. <laughs> uh, we are running around a little bit of time though. No, we could. We could. The season, don't you think? No, we could. It's 27 rounds. I guess so. You're correct. There's still, we're not even halfway through, mate. Yeah. 
Yeah, what are we, we doing? Don't, we don't panic, <laughs> Jason. We're not, even right. a, we're not even a third the way through. Um, Sharks four is very good again. Brenton Nikota doing a lot of mahi as per usual. Tom, Thomas Hazelton gets another fucking try. Bro, honestly, I, <laughs> I think... Like, oh, Brenton Nikota, I think he got 48. I don't think he missed one. Um... 48 tackles, no no misses, I believe. Oh, Brenton Tom Nicola. Hazelton, though. I think he's my favourite forward at the moment. He's so good to watch. He's everyone's favourite forward. Look at him. <laughs> um, also a bit of an underdog. Looks hard to tackle with his gangly like legs and stuff. Yeah, he's solid, eh? Solid carrier. No, I'm going to give it to the Bristol. <laughs> <laughs> missed a couple. Brenton missed a couple, but that's a lot of tackles. Um, Ronaldo. Doing Ronaldo Ting still. Um, him and... Uh, Isako are just locked in, I, I think. Yeah. The Kiwis, are, yeah, yeah, there's definitely. probably no other conversation at the moment. Nah. Nah. Because nah. they're both in very good form. Um, yes, Dragons don't have many Kiwis, so there's probably not much more to add to that one, mate. No. But um, Sharks, who, I wonder if they've got next week. Anyway, we'll soon see. Sharkies? Yeah. We'll soon see. Oh, they're versing Storm. <laughs> Without Jerome Hughes. At Amy Park. Oh, yeah, that'll be a good game. It'll be interesting. No Jerome Hughes. Who did you for your pick this week? I ended up going the Broncos. Ooh, no, no Adam. But who are they playing? Parramatta? Yeah. Do the, do the numbers on that, because I haven't. <laughs> so I'd love it if someone did. <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden he's starting to think, shit, okay. <laughs> Yeah. Um, All right. Um, anyway, yes. MVKs. MVKs. MVK, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Uh. Ooh, uh. Um, all right. Most valuable Kiwis, aka MVKs. We give out our three. We give it our two. We give it our one point. I am ready. Jace is ready. All right. My blank page that I didn't write down and get ready for. Um, <laughs> I will go first, though. Now, I'm going to give... Oh, shit. Oh, fuck, I always, get the, always um, change my mind. I'm going to give you Sarko one point. He had an outstanding game. Got any points yet? This year? Might not have. Shit. Oh, yep. Oh, yeah. Yep. Uh, two points to the fish. I thought he was, um, he flies under the radar a bit because he does the same thing most weeks, but he was dominant in the middle. Yeah, that's right. He's, he was at his menacing best. Yeah. First lot of points this week. Uh, yeah. Well done, James. He's looking at you like he's one of, you'd like, he looks at that look in his eyes like one of his kids got out of the car when you've told him to stay in the car while you've gone to the pokies. <laughs> well, yeah. It's that sort of face. Very descriptive right there. <laughs> get on that car, boy. <laughs> and you're, get, get on, on the boy. car. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, bloody Spencer Fillon, is it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, my three points, I've got to give it to Cody Nicolima, oh, man. Oh, yes. He's bloody had a good round. Lord of the Fins. Have he, has he got a point yet? I don't think he is. No. Don't even know if he, oh, There he is. is. Yep. Has he got a point? Oh, yes. I've given him three of me points. Cody. Yeah, well done, Cody. Well deserved, mate. And, uh, enjoy your cup of tea tonight. He's always had a. Uh, enjoy your ginger nuts. <laughs> he's always had a. Uh, he's always had that in him. Oh, yeah, 100%. Yeah. Um, but yeah, like you said earlier, just seeing him, do, we want to see him do it multiple times. Mm. I'm yes. sure that will mean the world to him, us saying that about him. Yeah, because oh, well. he's sure a big he'll fan really of this care. body. <laughs> You'll be like, who the fuck are these guys? Big right. of us. Well, he'll yeah. remember me from back in the day, bro. Oh, yeah, sweet. Played in all the cup grades with him. Down Danny, bro. You, oh, no, no, you know, just down the right. Um. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Sweet. Yep. All right, I'll do You've mine, got your three, yep, yeah, one. Yeah, boy. Um, one goes to Kyo Wheat. I've just got a halfback themed uh, points this week. It's being a fellow half, I'm just uh, I'm always watching them. Okay, okay. Kyo Weeks, one point. How do you spell his first name? Uh, K A E O. Oh, oh, oops. Kyo Kyo Weeks W. Oh, yeah. look, don't make me spell it on uh, the potty. It's <laughs> just do it however you <laughs> <laughs> I'll probably get it wrong, bro. Don't don't uh, don't Kyle ask me in front of you, Don't pay me out like that. There we go. So one point. Who's your dude going Second to? one goes to the big Foz. Mm. Just another Kiwi half. Just doing his thing. He's held together with bloody tape. Shout out to Mr. Foran. Enjoy your cup of tea tonight as well. And I'll have to give a uh, Kori Nikorima. Oh, yes. He's got the three as well. I see. He had to, man. It was just a flawless game. So, so you um, know your halfbacks well. Okay. Okay. Jason, who have you got? 
My tahi is. He's just scrolling, looking at all the names. Bro. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> Seb God. Chris. Oh yes. Seb Chris. Yeah, I had him on my list too. Sebi oh, Chris. Yes. Um, I think he was dynamic in that comeback. So nice. you know your rate as well. What's the charge? <laughs> my <laughs> my deuce points. <laughs> Jimaine Isako. Yes. <laughs> and my three points. <laughs> Sean. Jo- no. <laughs> I was going to say fucking hell. Probably Cody yeah. Nikarima as well. Big Cody. Codes. Well no, done. It was bro. so good to watch him just. Congrats, Cody. Excellent. Put the cup of tea away. Grab yourself a Neapolitan ice cream. Kevin full, ice cream. Full nine points for the bro. Um, building quite the combination with uh, Katoa. So, um, mm. yeah. Well done, Codes, you know. Looking Get to see that um, digress, eh? Be cool. Yep. Yes, yes. Oh, well done, mate. Uh, Kiwi moment of the week. Kiwi moment of the round. Is there one that stood out to you more than others? I've got one. I said it earlier. And it's the, it's the Joe Chan tackle. Oh, yes. Try saver. Oh, Had yes. absolutely no right to get over there. And he did. Took him out, I think, oh, which I can't remember which wing it was, but it's such a good tackle. I remember watching it going, shit, that's good. Wasn't there a, I feel like there was real one, like, funky, like, mean um, Isako try. Funky, even. Okay. Funky, okay. Can't remember. Isako. can't remember, though. Anyway. All right, great. Did you have one? Oh, mine is just probably what we've harped on about all night. Just Maybe the Kaio X try, that was good. That was gangster. Yeah, the Elliot offload to Kaio. Yeah, right, that, was yeah that was That was, not a Kiwi, but the Kiwi finished it. Yes. So, yeah, let's put that in there, yeah. Nice. Uh, yeah, struggling a little bit this week, eh? <laughs> With yeah. standout Kiwi moments, but... Joey Manu? I don't... But he finished know. it off from... Yeah. Dom Young, but still... Yeah, still a mean Joey. moment. Yeah, it was still similar to the Huddy Young. Oh, not the Huddy Young, the uh, Whitehead one. Yeah. Where he was on yes. the end of a mad pass. What about... Did you, did you watch Panthers game? No. Taruva? Was pretty much out. Oh, the yeah. The old flick back. Yes, he mean. knows the sideline well. Anyway... Next segment, eh? Succulent Chinese meal. Time to go win again. Win again. Top five, that's the minimum. Running a game plan. That's all militant. Roll reprise. Them guys were filling in. Change man, but the villain is still in them. Same Sam is top billing it. SJ23, they said it was done. I'm back home and killing it now. Matt coming through with the propane on the right. All right, that was PNC SJ23. You can find that on Spotify. Great, okay. Great, great song. This is Review. Preview, preview, sorry. <laughs> First game of the round. This is preview. Hit us. First Dolphins game. take on the Seagulls at Suncorp. Who's winning and why and who's your Kiwi to well, watch, okay, Jason? Just on that, because mm? we always do our Kiwi to watch, and I never remember who I say each game. So should we do a Kiwi to watch of the round? So you, we all pick one Kiwi of the round. Yeah, okay. We it's, just good to. To, no, it's just good to mention at each game, though. Okay, you know? sweet as. Dolphins I run Seagulls. shit here. Who'd be fun with us back? Okay. Who wins though? Dolphins, Sea Eagles. Who you, who you boys got? Who's Dolph- winning it? Dolphins. Dolphins, I feel like, too. Okay. I want to go Dolphins, too. And my Kiwi to watch is, I'm going to say, Jerry Marshall King for me. I have a feeling he might just get a try this week. I'm going Cody again. I want to see another repeat. Hopefully we see another repeat performance from him. Yes, yes. You, Jace? I'm going to go Kenny. Kenny nice. Bromwich. He's on the bench. Very good. Very good. Impact off the bench. Can play hooker at a pinch. Next game, Panthers, Doggies. It's not as easy picking as it would usually be with yeah. the form. But I'm still going to go Panthers. Penny Panthers. Uh, they, they, got, was, they got Cleary back, apparently. Yes. Oh, yes, I see, I see. Um, even less Kiwis now with injuries and shit. Um I think Moses Liotta's probably gone a bit quiet this this mm. last couple of games, so I'm looking for him to come out and actually murder some people. <laughs> yeah, absolutely murder. What about you guys, um, my Kiwi to watch, Nathan Cleary. All right, born in Auckland. Nathan <laughs> <laughs> um, Ah, Kareri, yes. Yeah, probably Liotta too. And for you, sir? Yeah, probably just going to go with Fishers for another repeat performance as, as we. Generally see him do. This is about when they should start, you know. Establishing dominance. Eh? Start to, like, find other yeah. extra gears. All right, next mm. game. Eels versus Broncos. <laughs> Broncos. Yes. Broncos. And I'm going to say... Brendan Piakura was quiet, so I reckon he's going to have a bounce-back game this game. Nice. 
I'm gonna go Jordan Nicky. Who? Mr. Jordan Ricky. Oh yes, sorry. Pretty Ricky. Jordan and Ricky for Jason. And for you, sir. Uh, I'll be Jermaine. Ah, uh, not Jermaine. <laughs> I, was, I was like, oh, okay. Sweet as bro. Suckle, bro. <laughs> Jermaine, Hup, Jermaine Hup, bro, bro. I don't even know, bro. I'm just, I'm just trying to look at the team list. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so you've got oh, Blaze Talang is playing fullback. Yeah, Guffo's yeah, out. Yeah, but he nice. he plays fullback in um. Yeah, that's right. New South Wales Cup. Is um, Blaze Kiwi? Oh, got to be with that. Yeah, name, I think right? he is. Yep. Yeah. Okay, Blaze. You got nice. Bailey Simonson, Dylan Brown. Oh, and I'm all. I'll just say Dylan Brown too. Nice. Yeah, it'd be nice to see him open and free running. When is when is Mitchell Moses back? Who knows? Too, uh, too busy um, splitting just, that Just before seat, um, <laughs> Origin, I believe. So like round eleven or something. Okay. Okay. A couple of weeks before. Nice. Um, West Tigers v Knights. Oh, I'm gonna go Tigers to get this one. Just just something for the multi. Yeah, I reckon Tigers too. Yeah, I said it last week. I've been saying it. I said it. Saying a lot, <laughs> I haven't won yet. I'm gonna go Knights. Oh, you would too, you prick. They played good <laughs> on the weekend against us. You reckon they played good? Better than us. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know I if they played good though. I yeah. Both teams were just like average. Eh? Well, like they came out has seen, and they had us under the pump, and then they kind of just went quiet. But yeah. they still played fair enough. Good. If you're gonna watch a Kiwi, which one's it gonna be? For me, I'm gonna go um, Isaiah Papali'i. At least need to give him some more quality balls so the bro can get more tries. Like, come on, man. Um, I'm going to go Dane Gregory. And Greg Maju. Big Gregory. Gregory. Tack- tackling people in the air ones, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Ain't getting away with it, so what's wrong? <laughs> I was going Papali as well. Just yeah, nice. It'll be good to see him open up. Open the legs. Open your legs, Ice. Now, Dragons v Rabbitohs. <laughs> Latrell Mitchell's back. Look at some of these players. So we got uh, Gehemet Shabasaski is in there. He's Michael yeah. Chikam. He's playing centre. Isaac Tui Tupo Thompson. Dion Tio Tupa. Shit. Well, Davey that's, Moale. That's quite the depleted uh, team. Sl- uh, Peter Mamazellas. Tellus Duncan. Thomas Burgess. Shit, and Mario. Matt French. Mario Fennick. <laughs> Geez, a desperate hero, Mario. They've even Fennick. called back some of the old greats. Yeah, who am I looking for? The Kiwis. I'll I'll, I'll be going with. Um, there's not many. Any well, Kiwis? There's not many. <laughs> I'm going to go Uncle Raymond. Yep, he's been playing well, bro. Mariner. Yep. yep, I think he's grown a bit of a leg since he's been with the uh, Dragons. Get it done, Dragons. So, yeah, I'd look, I, I think Dragons sealed the deal. And, Surely, uh, I'm looking for Raymond to really have a blind. And I'm going to go with uh, F- uh, Manu Brown off the interchange bench. Crazy that he's back in the NRL, isn't it? But yeah, spent mm. a few weeks over in England. A couple and thought, of weeks in England. This is not for me. Fair enough. Yes. Fair enough, brother. He's pretty open with his um, posts and stuff. Yeah. So yep. he's I'll be dragons too. Put it All out right. there, and uh, he's hot am I? Hot am I? Now Storm v Sharks. This is the probably the interesting one. Very hard to pick. Mm. It's first versus second, I believe. No, uh, Jerome Hughes. Uh, that'll tip it in the favour of the Sharks for me. Very hard place to go play, though. I think they're playing at Amy Park. Um, play to watch yep. Brinton knee quarter And they got no Pappy either too No Paps But they got that Next Absolute Live wire Sewer Yeah that's going to be cool Far long or Jeez he was good In the weekend eh Shit yeah. Surely born in Auckland How high does he jump Prior to doing the goose eh Like <laughs> In slow motion like, Look at this guy How come he's got so much time To do a massive jump <laughs> <laughs> If you're watching that in review It's like Just when he does that big jump Just tackle him then, Just okay? tackle him <laughs> Are you allowed to <laughs> Must be. If you jump like that, you're allowed to tackle out, I think. Fuck, who knows? Maybe that's why he does <laughs> it. Boom. And for you, Jason, did you say anyone? I don't know who to go to this game. Golden Point would be a good bet. Oh, <laughs> ah, yes. You know your margins well. Um, What's the charge? And Big Nels. Ronaldo. You want to go mit- Molotalo? I'll, I'll look at Big Nasty coming off the bench doing nasty things. Keep it nasty. Now. Roosters <sighs> v Warriors. Warriors, baby. Or is all day till I die, brother. This is yeah. a turning point for the boys. Mm-hmm. This is really going to stipulate to me whether we're we're in it. Yeah, if we're in it to win it. Wade Egan's just going to open them up. It's time to stand up. And even just reading, like it's we don't have the excuse of all these injuries too. Like we've got a pretty stacked yeah. lineup still. You know, got a good t- obviously we're missing a got couple. Got Jesse back. We're missing a couple. Do like you know Marata what? And stuff. But like you look at that team, and I'm like, yeah, fuck yeah. Like give me that start of the year, I'll be. 
Adam Pompey named it 17 minutes. 17 min- uh, yeah. I don't know about that. Yeah. Wouldn't you bring oh, is he 17? What's old Chanel up to? Kill? Injured. He's not back. Is he till. injured? Is he injured in New South Wales? Cut. No, he must have had a slight injury and then they've. Oh. I'm pretty sure I read he's not back to like 13 or something. Or so the other thing or is. Or maybe like 12 or something. That's a waste of a. Come on. Because Dill Walk can play centre. Yeah. If you need someone to, like, and you can juggle it around. I just think we're lacking, like, a, a Zion Mayu. Yeah, he was good, man. If you look at the size of the bench, like, Tom Alley is pretty short in stature. <sighs> it's a, he's it's powerful. A, it's a nuggety bench, bro. It's a like nuggety literally bench. Literally, that top three, Dylan, Tom, and Nugget, Jazz. Nothing but nuggies. But, hey, that's we love nuggies, and what nuggies can do when they're on, like, Yep, if we see quick, the ball brothers, quick legs. I reckon the rule if, if you want to play brother effect, brother bench for the Warriors, you have to ball head. With the exception of um, Bunty, because he's starting this week, and then Mitch Barnett's to second row. Yeah, Bunty doesn't need to cut his hair. Ever. No, I reckon they all need to shave their head. Correct. Let's uh, hope Dylan and Jazz are shaved and ready to go. Would you still keep Adam on the bench like that? Adam Pompey. Is that a waste of a spot? Yeah, I don't think he even played in the weekend. He didn't even play in the weekend. And how good it would have been to have like another Ford come on. Oh, did we have him on the bench last week? Mm. Yeah. Exactly. And we just didn't use him. We didn't yeah. use him. And then we lost. Did we lose a player as well? Yeah, Kurt Capewell. Kurt Capewell, That's yes. Right. He so we played again. with 15 players. And didn't have. And he just didn't put them on. No. Christ. Yeah, yeah I, don't so know. I don't know. I don't know about that tacky. Uncle Webby's tactic is there, but. Because I would love to see Zion. My maybe, ooh, mm, there. maybe he doesn't want to be caught out with not having a back if a back goes down. But Dylan can slide out. Yeah. He's played half and like centre. He played centre for Australia. Mm. So um, interesting. Yeah. Oh, Warriors sweet. to just sneak in, I reckon. And your Kiwi to watch. There's plenty in it. Uh, I'm looking for a big one from um, from Dallin. I reckon he'll get about three tries. I hope so. Just Back. people are paying him out a little bit. All of a sudden, he's had yeah. a couple yeah. of, couple of below par games for his own for that same reason for his, his standards. own standards. And it doesn't normally go there, but I'm going to go to Mighty. Yeah. I reckon he's yeah. going to do something. He's got a stand up. Yeah, it's not just. He's some good runs in the weekend. Like yeah, he th- did. Yeah, a couple of show and goes. Yeah, it? yep. I'm going to go. Charles Nicol Clockstad probably wasn't his best game he's played, is it? No. And I think uh, he doesn't do that often. So no, never. Same never. as Dell. So very rarely. I reckon they're going to watch that. They'll be fired up. All those jaggers calling him out. Just calm it down, okay? <laughs> and for the love of God, give it to those posters. Yes. yes. Uh, Nick game. Titans v Cowboys. This is going to be a good game. Yes, another North, another Queensland derby. Sorry, did the Titans get them? Yeah, I, I feel like they do. Yeah, I reckon. Yeah, AJ Brimson, man, bro, how they're way better with him at fullback. He's a clinic, bro. He's running, he's running a goddamn clinic, baby. Hey, I think with them trying to figure out how to fit him and Jaden and Kenny at one stage all on the team is yeah. just not worth it. No, you lose so much mm. everywhere else by he, doing that. He is honestly, he's one of the best fullbacks in the comp right now, bro. Yeah. Just his attacking and his defence, oh, eh? He's out. He's he's an absolute mongrel. Watching him live, I just I just shake my head every time he got the ball or, or when he was around the ball. I was just yeah. nervous. I was yeah. nervous. That's it. That's when you know. Like Tyrell Sloan is a mean player, but imagine having Jaden Campbell in that Dragons team. Yep, yep, he could go well there. I just think they need. You know how they get the same with New South Wales. You get too many good players and mm. you try to fit them mm. all in. It just doesn't work. Um, but yeah, I'm going. I'm going Titans. Where you going, man? Titans, man, they've been yeah, there. The We're all Titans. Yeah, yeah. Keep yeah. it to watch. Keep it to watch. Surely this is the Foz. Foz all day. I'm gonna go Aaron Clark. Nice, Aaron. Yeah, good on you, Aaron. Oh, Kenny's on the bench. Is he gonna play 14? Apparently, interesting. Because mate, has Randall been playing 14? Because they lost a ton of Boyd. Oh yes, broken. Maybe. So he might Something here. Interesting. Oh, yeah. That's he right. might come in. He's very fast. They'd be good around the ruck. I'd say it'd be an entertaining game, this one. You always mm. get a pretty entertaining yep. game with the. Because that game that Titans. Cowboys Dolphins, that was a try for try, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. Last try wins, basically. Pretty much. <laughs> Looking forward to it in the weekend of 40. All right. Uh, was that the last game, was it? Yep. Yeah. All right. Uh, that is Reeve the Round. We've got our best bet section coming up. Kane's pick get up last weekend. I think he did money for a double or something. Down Ronaldo. Hey, yeah, I'm oh, not money. M- M- Ronaldo Molotalo. didn't get a try, eh? No. Nah. So none of us. Great none start. On negative 10. All right. Best bets. What did Kane, aka okay, that Kiwi punter, send through for us, Mike? Um, punt this weekend is Mariner anytime against the Eels. 
Mariner has scored in five out of his seven games this season. His own uh, his only game against Para, he scored a double last season. Man of man on wheels and should be catching Sevo out on defence. I like it. I like it. So Mariner anytime peeps. Nice. Um well they'd be paying like a dollar two. No, the prob- breather up to now. Prob- have, have we forgotten about Mariner too? Is it, is it is Kiwi? Yeah, he's a Kiwi. Born in Auckland, eh? Yeah. His dad sung that matter of yeah. first song. Yeah. <laughs> he's a bloody good player, man. Quite feel like we've let him go under the radar. He looks like Latino, huh? <laughs> he does look a little Latino. He, dri- he drives a Mr. Bichy Labaro, I think. <laughs> <laughs> um, my best bet of the round, I'm going to go back to my old faithful because I've been putting the hoodoo on these fucking wingers I'm trying to pick. So I'm on a nudie run still. So I'm going Brenton Nekwater. Oh, oh, I thought you were going to say Ice Puppy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, they're both my old faithfuls. Oh, Puppy. Oh, great. Brenton Nekwater for me any time. Running the hard man line. Yes. Bang. Oh, yes. Bang. You used to run that line, eh? Yeah, on an odd occasion. Once a year. Once or, or twice. <laughs> 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 once or twice when I got moving. Um, if Best bet, bro. You got one? Best bet would be um, Dallin for uh, for two plus tries. Dallin in two or more. Yeah. Or we get we up for redemption, baby. What about you, Jace? I am okay. Jordan <laughs> Jordan Ricky anytime. Oh, Jordan Ricky anytime. Didn't he get the first try this week? Was that last week? Uh, it might have been last week. Jordan Ricky anytime though. Nice. Three forty-five value. Three forty-five. So you had an idea for another part of the betting segment. I'll just put you on the spot. Mm-hmm. But it's good. Can you smell out what Jason Weatherly is picking? And it has to be value. So you have to give us a value bet. So that's like, you know, that's when you usually do your best work, though. It's over over 10 buck. Yeah, love oh, oh I already got one for you. What? Sharks, Storm, Golden Point. Oh, Sharks, Storm, Golden Point. There Can you smell a little what Jason Weatherly is p- cooking? <laughs> cooking slash picking. Oh, and picking. that's definitely over $10. It's over $10. So fill your boots. And if, it's, if it doesn't come in, where do you live again? Um, <laughs> right I, I live right. on 4265 State Highway 29. 29 We got it wrong So that's good Four no six worries. Seven, seven. No worries bro <laughs> No worries bro Anyway Thank you for that And with that That would bring an end To the show We'd like to thank Our special guest Harmawira Brookie For jumping on mate It's been an absolute pleasure Call up next week you reckon It's been great to talk Rugby league with you fellas Yeah it's been mm-hmm. good Good to have you on And uh, thank you for a Probably below average show Jason Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> but still, still get named in the squad next week. <laughs> Good luck to the Kiwis out there this weekend. Go hard, boys. Up the Kiwis. All right, Jason, for your karu or fatu, where should they find us, man? YouTube. All right, and for your talinga? Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Podbean. You oh, on our right. socials? Yeah, fucking oath. Uh, Lenny Brookie is at... No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I could do it with a few more personal followers. Um, we're on Facebook. Flacial. Instagram, the gram, TikTok, tech here talk. Um, l- check out our LinkedIn, LinkedIn, <laughs> OnlyFans, you name it, we're doing it. Um, but yes, thank you for listening. Don't forget to subscribe on all that shit, like it, review us, and as always, give them a taste, give them a bloody taste. Up the wires and stay horny. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it takes, and you're ready today to take them all off. You got the measure of your man and you know that you can go all the way. Give it to him. Yeah, give him a taste. Give it, give it, give it.